you guys think? I think it's so floofy and so nice. We're still putting on the lights, but I think it's so cute and I love my little star. I got the star at the cross in Yale Town. I am so excited to have a real tree. Ben didn't want a real tree. He wanted to get a fake one because that's what his family's done. And my family's always done a real tree. We're trying out a real tree. If it doesn't work, we'll get a fake one, but I have a feeling we might like the real tree. Of course it's gonna work. <laughs> Dad actually yeah. picked out the tree because I got the timing wrong at the nursery <laughs> one time it closed. Okay. So yeah, Dad did a great job at picking the tree. Thanks, Dad. You're welcome. <laughs> My heart is racing. I'm so excited. Can you, you tell me when you want me to plug it in. Okay, Three, it. Oh, two, two, one. one. Ah, it's super cute. Oh my cute. gosh, it's so pretty. Yeah, I love the color of light. <gasps> Oh my gosh, it looks so Tootie. good. Our first real Christmas tree. <laughs> Tootie. She's kissing Dad on the face. Yeah, she's thankful. She says, good job, Dad. Yeah, look at a real Christmas tree. Okay, now you, now you can Yay. start up. Yay. Pipsy poop. Pipsy poop. Pipsy poop. Pip. You've got a treat. Tootie too. Do, do, do. So Daddy did such a good job. Wow. <laughs> look, Tootie. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I'm gonna hang a bunch of the ornaments now. I don't have that many since it's our first real Christmas tree, but I got some from the cross. I absolutely love, love, love their Christmas ornaments. And I'll show you guys afterwards. Okay, we're about to go for a walk with the dogs. So I have my jacket on, but I wanted to show you guys the ornaments that I've got on the tree. So as you can tell, I don't have very many at all yet, but that's okay, it's our first tree. What I do have, martini glass, abominable snowman, a couple of French baguettes, an eclair, an owl, a little like, I mean, I don't think it's actual glass. No, it's not, it's not glass, but it's a deer. A little mouse. I wanted to do different textures on the tree and I really loved the idea of having wooden ornaments. So I wanna get more of these, but for now I have a wooden mushroom. <laughs> have to keep it classy and have a champagne bottle. And lastly, a little angelic mouse with a halo. So cute. Oh, I think I already showed you guys. The little star I got at the cross. Actually, everything's from the cross. So if you like any of those ornaments, make sure to go shop at the cross. Okay, so right now we are in Yale Town and we're about to go into a Christmas market. I don't know what this one is called, but it's the one. Vancouver, no. It's like the Roundhouse. Roundhouse, Yale Town, Roundhouse. Yeah, it's the market in there and we're pretty excited to go in. It looks super cute. We can kind of see in the windows right now. We're here together. This is Heidi and Felicity. And where's Titi? She's right there. She's like wrapped around me. We're going to the markets right now because it's kind of a fun way to support local and it's a fun Christmas thing to do because there's always Christmas music and Christmas treats. So yeah, let's see what we can find. home and I thought I would do a quick Christmas market haul for you guys okay so the first thing I'll show you guys is something that I have already tried and loved so much so I bought it again it's this mr. mead honey wine I got their honey and cranberry infused mead and it's so freaking good all of my friends loved it let me show you the bottle this is what the bottle looks like and it's this gorgeous cranberry looking color. It's made in British Columbia and it is 14% alcohol. So yeah, I highly recommend these guys if you're at one of the Christmas markets and you see them, give her a go. Next are these Christmas cards. They say merry and bright on them. I just really loved the sagey green color of them and I liked that they were paper envelopes. When I say paper envelopes, I mean like the natural looking paper, like the brown color. I think I'm gonna stick to this sort of tone for my wrapping paper as well and then put them under the tree. I just love natural tones and nat natural textures for things. And then I also, 
I also got like a tiny little pin that says take care. There you go. Take care. I'm gonna put it on my jean jacket. And that's from Calligraphy Co. And her name was Isabel. Next up are these coffee beans that I got for Ben. I would love for them to be for me, but I can't drink coffee because of my migraines. It's from Trek Coffee Canadian Roasters. And it's a medium roast, chocolate, syrupy, and toffee. I mean, that appeals to me and it smells so good, guys. Oh my God, it smells incredible. So I'm hoping Ben likes that. I was maybe gonna keep this as like a stocking stuffer kind of thing or like a small gift on the side. So on Christmas morning, he can try out his new coffee. But then I just found out that you wanna have beans really fresh. So I'm debating whether or not I should give this to him now or wait till Christmas. I don't know. And then lastly, I got some scrunchies. I always like to put my hair up to wash my face before I go to bed. And I just find that if I used a regular elastic, they're always just like very tight and it doesn't need to be that tight on my head. So I wanted to get some just cute little scrunchies that I can use. So it's just loosely tied up. So this one has little lambs on it. This one is just regular gray stripes. And this one has little puppy dogs on it. I think these will look so cute with my waffle robe. The fabric is really cozy too. Okay, well that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys like this video, give it a like or comment down below what your favorite item was that I purchased and even subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.